What's up guys, thank you very much for joining me today. Again, I'm going to show you a quick video today how you can reset your BMW iDrive system. So what we're doing now is the hard way of resetting. All you have to do is just press a couple of buttons in and that will reset itself. And if there's any bugs in the system, it will clear itself. So this reset is not actually clearing your history or anything. So it's just turning off and turning back on, just like an, an, a, on a normal laptop. When you restart the laptop, it just reboots everything from fresh. And I think it's wise to do that time to time if you have any issues like Bluetooth connectivity, a software update issues. Um, I recently updated my vehicle um, iDrive system, so I'm going to leave a link above and also in the description should you want to wish, wish to upgrade your software, your iDrive software system. So that video goes um, in detail step by step. So this video is very short. So now I'm going to show you step number one. Turn on the ignition. The ignition is on. Step number two, all you need to do is, you've got the mode button and the power button. You're just gonna press it and hold until you see your iDrive goes off. So all I'm doing is I'm pressing them down so that my iDrive went off, as you can see that. And then what it will do is it will reboot back up itself and that should be it, good to go. So that's coming back on, voila. All set as your BMW has resetted the iDrive system. Well, so. you have just made to the end of today's video. If you find this video useful, make sure that you hit the like button and also subscribe if you're new here. If you want to see the most recent video that I've made about the iDrive software update, be sure you hit the link in the description so if you want to update your iDrive system. Thank you very much for stopping by. Till next time, Peace out.